Meet Catherine. She's getting older and needs more care than her family can provide. Her daughter Beth realizes mom needs professional senior care now. It's a tough decision, made tougher trying to figure out how to pay for the cost of senior care. Then, Beth remembers something she heard about converting life insurance into funds to pay for senior care while someone's still alive. This is exactly what her mother needs, since Catherine has a life insurance policy with premiums that are getting very costly. Beth does some research and finds valuable information about using life insurance to pay for senior care. She learns that an existing life insurance policy can be converted into a long-term care benefit plan with monthly payments to cover the costs of senior care, whether that's home care, an assisted living community, a nursing home, or even Alzheimer's care or a hospice. And any type of life insurance could qualify. Universal or term policies with absolutely no cash value could still have a hidden value as immediate payments for senior care. And to think her mother was going to throw away her life insurance policy because she couldn't keep making the payments. Now, Catherine may be able to preserve her home and savings and spare her family the strain and guilt of funding her care. Beth's happy to learn there are no costs or fees involved and no obligation once the policy is valued. If mom qualifies and enrolls, the monthly benefit payments start immediately with no more life insurance premiums to pay ever again. But Catherine's a little skeptical. What about money when I die? How will you pay for my funeral? She asks. It says right here, says Beth, reading, the benefit plan reserves a portion of your account to help cover funeral expenses, and should you die before the entire account has been spent, any remaining balance will be paid to your family. Catherine's relieved she won't be a financial burden on her family, and Beth is happy she's found a way to get Mom the care she needs. They both finally feel in control of Catherine's care. The life insurance premiums Catherine's paid consistently for so many years will finally pay off now when she really needs it. Political leaders and advocacy groups across the country are endorsing this form of private pay for senior care. And it's an accepted form of payment by every home care, assisted living, and nursing home company in the United States. Convert your policy into a long-term care benefit and choose the form of care you want. Before you abandon your life insurance policy, you owe it to yourself and you owe it to your family to see if you qualify.